Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how you can create your own iTunes account without any sort of payment. So you don't need a gift card or you don't need a credit card to create this. So, um, so basically the first thing you want to do is you want to search for an app on the on the uh, App Store that is completely free. It must be a free app or else you can't do it. So I will just uh, type in Angry Birds Lite, any Angry Birds Rio free, I'll use that. Okay, so yeah, so once you find a free app, just click the word free. Now, from there, you want to create, you want to press create new account. So yeah, you don't have an account yet, you want to press create new account. Okay, so now from this, you'll see this welcome to iTunes store, just press continue. Hold on, I'm just waiting for it to load up the page. Alright, so now you want to just uh, agree to the terms and conditions, just press that little uh, check right there, and then just press continue. And now you just create your uh, your your account. So I'll just use my email. I just made an email before I made the video. Just use a password. Hold on. All right. Then you just need to use a question to verify your account. If you ever need to like change something or anything like that, so I'll just do. What is your YouTube channel? and then you just have to answer it okay now you have to put your date of birth so I'll just put a fake one just boom boom 1973 of course that is fake and just don't need that okay your password must be at least eight characters long alright hold on let me just change it that's just my mistake that that is just my mistake. All right, so so just make that and then just press continue. Your password must contain at least one numeral. Okay, wow, this isn't going well. All right, now we're good. Okay, so once you made your you once you put in your personal information, now you have to go into your payment method. So you'll see credit card, uh, gift card, and billing address. Just press this right here. This none. See this none right here? Press that. And that's all you have to do. Press none and then press continue. Okay, sorry, sorry. You press none and then you have to put in your information. All right, I forgot about that. Okay, so then put in your, put in your, uh, your username. Just put in a fake address. Just um, Rosa Parks Lane in the city of Los Angeles in the state of California. Zip code of that's probably not going to match. Your zip code must be a five digit five digit number, optionally followed by the plus four extension. Okay, then I'll just change my zip, my city to Rancho Cordova because I know I know um what the zip code is for that city hold on and that should work your phone number must be okay wow all right all right that's good okay so yep just press your none and that's it just put in your information don't do any of the mistakes I did and boom you just need to verify your ID so I'm gonna I'm going to go to my email and then verify it so hold on let's see if I have it up all right, so here's my email. I fake. If you look right here, I fake iTunes at Hama .com. I got my message from iTunes from Apple, and just press verify now. And just put in your um, your password. Hold on. I'll never be using this this uh, account because I already I have my own. So, oh, my Apple ID is I fake iTunes account. Hold on, I fake iTunes at hotmail dot com. All right, and that should be good. Yep. All right, email address verified. Thank you for verifying your address. Uh, my email is now associated with the Apple ID. So, I'm now. Back on the, I'm back on iTunes. I press done. I already verified my account, and let me just see. 
Now let me just sign in. So Apple ID, I fake iTunes at hotmail dot com. And my password. And you look right there. I fake iTunes at hotmail dot com. I have my own I have my own uh, account. So one thing you can do with your account is you can buy anything that is free in the app store. Anything that costs, you obviously can't because there's no payment on record, but I'll just show you what I mean. So Angry Birds Rio free. I'll just go to that on my account and you see how it says free. I'll, I want the guide for Angry Birds Seasons because it's free. I can click the free button and it starts downloading. So I now am downloading an app from the app store on an account that I have no payment on. But if it does cost, you can't do it. So, like, for instance, um, if there was an app that did cost, you could not. I'll show you what I mean by that. So, let me just go to the actual Angry Birds Rio. Alright. So, Angry Birds Rio is right here. So, it says 99 cents. So, you click that. Are you sure you want to download Angry Birds Rio? Buy. And then, you'll have to put in your password, which it should say, no payment on record. And okay, so you go to billing info. I'm just showing you what I mean by this. You don't have to do this, obviously. I'm just showing you how you cannot get anything that does cost in the App Store. All right, so my billing info should say none. I have no payment on record. Um, I guess it's just loading. It's being slow. I'll just cancel that. All right, so yeah, guys, that is basically it. Um, so yeah, now you can just go on iTunes and create your own iTunes account without using any sort of payment. Um, if you do like this video, please like it, please favorite it, uh, please subscribe if you haven't already, I'd appreciate that. And that is it. Please go make your account on iTunes. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.